Good morning, everyone. We are hiking through Connecticut right now, which is exciting because we're in New England. And the next state up will be Massachusetts, which is my home state. Okay, so we've been hiking for all of 10 minutes and I'm already absolutely disgusting. And although I'm grateful you guys can't smell me through this video, I feel that you deserve to know the reality of the situation, which is that it has been extremely hot and humid lately, and it's been raining off and on, so everything is damp. We smell like swamps. <laughs> Our shoes smell like roadkill. <laughs> Luke has discovered baby powder recently. The best. Um, due to a chafing situation. <laughs> but we've discovered that if we dump it all over ourselves, it helps a little bit. Um, and then the mosquitoes have been terrible, so we're dousing ourselves in bug spray every five minutes. So now we basically just smell like a combination of swamp, roadkill, baby powder, and bug spray. So yeah, hygiene is important to me, but unfortunately this is the best we can do in the situation. So that is something to look forward to if you ever decide to through hike. Trail walks us right by this high school. Kids are in school though. Alright, let's see if we can make this thing register. You going for it? Just shot me with baby powder. Okay, we had a really nice lunch by the waterfall and it felt good to get wet and wash up a little bit. Although now we've just done a thousand foot climb and I think we're back at square one. Look at that thumb. I'm on the giant's thumb. Give us two thumbs and up. No, I'm not going to handstand up here. <laughs> Everybody's going to comment that. 1,500 miles. Feels like the big one. So, this is a new one. Our next water source that's available is at a cemetery. So, I guess we're going to take a break. Hey, found a prey whale, h and Block, Antique Center, Rental Center, Eagle Shoe and Boot. Almost the camp, guys. <laughs> if you ever find yourself lost, son. A shelter with a view. All right, we're getting set up. Beautiful night. So, how was your privy experience? It was great. What well, happened? Anything noteworthy? There was a porcupine next to the toilet when I walked in, and it, was, it looked like a baby. So I didn't have time to deal with the porcupine at that moment because I had to go. Um, then. 
I went back and hinged the door open and let him up. He's cute. All right, we got dinner with the view this evening. Oh. Booyah. All right, it's that time. See you tomorrow. All right, good morning from the top of Bear Mountain, where we have no view. Kind of a bummer, we've got three decent sized peaks this morning, and they're the biggest ones we've had lately, over 2,000 feet, um, but it's raining and we will not have a view today. But we are heading into Great Barrington, Massachusetts today, my home state, so I'm excited. See you later. Okay, just kidding, now we're on the summit of Bear Mountain, which is this big rock pile. And as you it's poncho time. Hey, we're sitting under a little rock ledge right now, having our snack break because it is still raining outside. <laughs> Massachusetts. Okay, we've made it up to Mount Race. It rained on us most of the way up here. It would have been beautiful views. It was really like cliffy on the way up. And uh, now we are on to Mount Everett. that on camera. Uh -huh. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. All right, we've conquered the three peaks of the day. It was a bit of a struggle. My uh, tread on my shoes is kind of worn down like six, 700 miles later. And the wet rocks, it was like trying to climb down ice. We have a few more miles to go, hopefully flat ones, until we get to Great Barrington, Massachusetts. Penis tree right number two. All right, we've made it 17 and a half miles to the road crossing where we're getting picked up by a shuttle and heading to Great Barrington. We made it! Hello. <laughs> we are chilling outside the Lantern House Motel. It was a good day. <laughs> we did 17.5 miles and it was rainy and slippery and kind of miserable, but we made it to, uh, what's this town? Great Barrington. Great Barrington, Massachusetts. Did our resupply at uh, Price Choppers, which was actually, I thought it was going to be a crap discount store, but it was a good grocery store. Nice. Got some Mickey D's. Came back, did some laundry in the shower since they don't have laundry here, so that was quite a project. And. Did you show them the kick ass? I'm gonna show them the kick ass yeah. clothesline that Luke made. Yep. So now I'm gonna organize my food and get shit straight and head to bed. See you tomorrow. Good morning. Alright, 7.30 and we are waiting on our ride to come get us and so the donut shop is right next door to the motel and I don't think you guys understand how much I love donuts so I'm going back to get more even though I already had two. Good morning, Massachusetts. 
I thought I should mention actually that although I live in Massachusetts, I don't live anywhere near here <laughs> in Massachusetts. I'm probably like, I don't know, three hours away on the other side. So I've never even hiked in this area before. All of my hiking experience has been in the White Mountains in New Hampshire. So that will actually feel more like home to me when I get there. I live about like two hours from the White Mountains. Anyways, back on the trail. I'm feeling good this morning. I'm not sure why. I've been a little not excited about hiking lately, to be honest, but um, but today I feel good. We're doing kind of a shorter day anyways because there's like a whole section where you can't really camp anywhere. There's one campsite and there's an exclamation point on it on gut hooks because there's been an aggressive bear with cubs hanging around there. So you really shouldn't camp there. So I think we're only doing like 13 miles. So that makes me kind of happy. <laughs> it's supposed to rain, but whatever. We're used to it. Anyways, see you later. Massachusetts is so flat. We just had three donuts each for breakfast. Now, Luke, what are you eating? I'm doing the Heath Bar dip in peanut butter, like so. Evan, what you doing? Uploading a video to YouTube. <laughs> this is a real AC. <laughs> And heading back up again. So we just got into North Mount Wilcox shelter and gonna get set up. We did 13.5 miles today and it was a really nice day. I think it was partly because of the donuts and coffee I had this morning. But yeah, Massachusetts has been treating us really nicely. I know I'm kind of biased because I'm from here, but oh well. Okay, one of the chores I never really show is blowing up the stupid air mattress, which makes you really lightheaded. And I like to have contests with Luke to see who can blow it up faster? She's Let's see. Whoop. All right, it's dinner time <laughs> on the 18th. <laughs> What's everybody having? Evan? Cheese block. <laughs> Luke? Tuna. What's making Luke? Triple hot cocoa. What do you mean by triple hot cocoa? Three packets. <laughs> Gangsta. <laughs> it's like it's wet down there. It does. It's gross. Love bear boxes. Alright, it's that time. Don't judge me for going to bed while it's still light out. <laughs> See you in the next video.